Hey y'all, um, so today, well, I just got back from a run, obviously, um, and I wanted to talk to you about the, the products that I tried out today. Um, about a month or so ago, I think it's been a little bit longer, I started following um, Columbia, Columbia the, um, the brand, no, um, on Twitter, and the cool thing about Columbia on Twitter is they actually have a person behind the name on Twitter, which is pretty cool. Uh, instead of just like blasting you with like oh, our products are fantastic, blah blah blah, he actually interacts with you. His name is Adam, I believe. Um, but it's cool. So one day he threw out a tweet and he said, "Where are you tweeting from?" And I, I just <laughs> randomly responded I'm tweeting from Ohio and he responded that they'd like to hook me up with some products and for free no charge whatever nothing I don't even have to do this but I wanted to talk to you about the products but it was awesome um, not only did they send me I got a jacket uh, I got the base layer which I'm going to show you in a minute um, but also I happened to say my dad and my husband are going to be super jealous because we are like a Columbia family. We have Columbia up the wazoo and especially the guys. They just absolutely love it. And he said, well, we can't leave them out either. I'm going to send them a coat too. So I was like, holy bleep. Yeah, not only did they send me stuff, but they sent my husband and my dad something. So holy crap, props to them. Then I got the products and um, my jacket was a little bit too snug and... I, I sat on it for a few days, and I didn't want to complain about it, but I responded, and I said, you know, it's a little snug, and he said, We're, we'll send you out another one, and I'm like, well, I can send this old one back, or the one that you already sent back, and he said, nope, you keep it, so um, I'm going to do a review on the jackets a little bit later, but I wanted to do a review on the base layers um, today. Today, I'm in northern Ohio. It is, I believe, last I checked, 21 degrees out with 20 mile per hour winds out of the northwest. So it feels like eight degrees. That's what the thing said. So um, I needed to run. I'm gonna blog about it a little bit later, but I'm trying to get away from treadmill running in the winter and get back to my roots, which was outside running. So I bit the bullet today and I went out and ran. Hence why I'm all done up. Since it's so cold, I figured this was the prime opportunity to give the Omni Heat a chance and see what I thought about it. Um, number one, it comes in these cool like little boxes. I don't know if you can see it. Um, and it, you know, obviously it's out of the box now, but it came rolled up into it and it talks about everything. And the basis behind Omni Heat is basically it reflects the heat back into your body. And um, I'm going to show you. I went out and I also um, bought some gloves that had the technology. I'm going to show you the gloves. See how it's silvery? Basically, it reflects your heat back, or that's what they claim, that it reflects your heat back and makes you so much percent warmer. And I was like, oh, well, you know, I'll give it a try and see what it is. Well, um, when I started getting dressed today, I sat down and I started putting my shoes on, and I was like, what the heck? What is... And then it like rang, it rang a bell with me. Oh my gosh, this stuff makes me warm, or it's supposed to make me warm, and it did. I'm not kidding. Like just putting my shoes on, I wasn't like super hot, but it just kind of is this, ooh, like fusion of just a little bit of warmth. It was pretty cool. So, um, obviously, I wouldn't recommend like running around your house in it, and then going out for a run or whatever. Not running around your house, but like being active in your house because you don't want to sweat and then have to go out in the cold and sweat again. So um, don't don't recommend that. But I would definitely recommend trying the product just because it definitely did. I noticed it inside. When I Then when I went outside, um, I just did a quick three-mile run. I wasn't even worried about time or anything. I just, I needed to get out and I knew that it was going to be a hard run just in general. So I just figured, you know, just go. And I was pretty impressed by the product. I, I stayed warm on my bottom. Um, I have just Adidas Astro Pants. You can't see them. So they're just normal, like, they're not tights, but um, they're just the Astro Pants. And then um, I put the base layer on underneath them. Same concept. They have the, like, metallic -y inner liner. And then up top... I'm not going to undress all the way for you guys, but um, I have, this is a C9 top from Target, and then this is a Nike thermal top, and to be quite honest, I was kind of worried about overdressing, but I didn't, I don't think I did overdress, but, so I have that, and then um, this is the Columbia, 
probably can't see it. And it's kind of cool because they gave me like a rainbowy color and that's just like so me. I love it. So, um, but, so I have the three on top and then the two on the bottom and at 21 degrees with the wind and everything, I actually stayed pretty warm considering the circumstances. Um, when it came to the gloves, the gloves were not given to me. Like I said, um, I went out and bought them. Actually, my mom and dad bought them for me for Christmas. Um, they're really thin, which is kind of what I like for running. Um, they weren't super warm, and I don't blame it on the gloves because I went with a thinner pair instead of the thicker pair, and I have been in search of gloves like crazy, trying to find what I, I need because my extremities and my fingers, it's just like the first half mile is just wicked, and then then I'm fine afterwards, but that first half mile is wicked. Um, and today it was kind of the same thing, I have to admit. I ended up pocketing my uh, pepper spray, and um, I was hoping nobody would mug me or anything, and if they're crazy enough to be out there in that weather, then they're stupid, but if you're an abductor, you're stupid anyway, so that really didn't make sense. But either way, <laughs> um, I ended up, you know, having to ball up my hands in the gloves, and once I balled up my hands, they were awesome, so I'm wondering if, I don't know if they have like a mitten pair. And if they do, maybe I could try that. That'd be pretty cool. Um, but then after I warmed up my hands, I was fine. And they were they were doing the warmth um, thing that the Omni Heat does. So that's pretty cool. I'm going to do a little bit more review probably um, written on my blog. I have some pictures of the actual product. So I don't have to like sit here and undress for you guys and show you specifically what the product looks like. And then I'm also going to do um, a review on the coats. Um, I'm still ch testing that out and things like that. Like I said, it was just kind of a thing I happened to stumble on on Twitter. Um, and I love Columbia, so I figured I'd, you know, just kind of give them a little bit of feedback and you guys a little feedback because I know some people would probably be interested in it, especially on um, athletes, whether you ski, snowboard, run, whatever, if you're active. So I will post a little bit more. Keep smiling. Be grateful, guys. See you later.